sacrifice Of bell I cannot sell it time Quite a few hand on my line Smoke and drink Corona with the lines I think it's my time Make a sacrifice so felt I cannot tell the time Why the few hitting up my line Smoke and drink Corona with the lines I think it's my time Make a sacrifice So felt I cannot tell the time Why the few hitting up my line Smoke and drink Corona with the lines I think it's my time I got what you want I got what you need Yo, what is up with this by Sage D here? Back from another video. Today in this video, we're gonna be doing another video in Monster Energy Super Cross the official video game three. Today in this video, we're actually gonna be doing an arena cross track. So I've actually done a video where I created a motocross track in the game. So that one actually did pretty well. So I thought I would do an arena cross track this time. And then maybe I'll do another video on trying to make a huge ginormous super cross track. Like trying to make it as long as possible. So if you guys wanna see that, let me know in the comments below. And obviously I am back of doing more videos because obviously with the pandemic going on i've had a lot more free time but still a little bit busy doing some other stuff but hopefully i can continue uploading videos more often so with that being said let's go ahead and hop into it all right so we're going to do a new track and we're going to do the smallest one so we're going to do a indoor rectangular stadium all right so we're going to do a let's see don't want to go too crazy might have to do a custom start so let's see i'm gonna have to delete one of these so i guess we'll just delete whatever this one is and then we'll go back up this one and let's see how small we can get it because i know arena cross tracks usually have it like set in the back corner just like how we had it in salt lake on the last few rounds they actually started doing that just so this first section is literally just to start and then we'll have the whole shot guess we'll have to put in a straight like this a little bit more all right so we're gonna have it stick out like this we're gonna have it turn in on itself a little bit like that and then we'll have in the next berm and then we'll have another straight like this I'm gonna have to back that up, put in a little bit more straights, make this a small turn right here, and have that straighten out, and this will be where the finish line jump is, and then we'll have it go back onto itself. So now that we got it laid out, we can go ahead and put in the jumps. So right here is our first little straight. So we gotta remember that these are not factory bikes, these are much smaller bikes. So we'll have in a little jump like this, and then we'll actually have that go onto a table, then we'll space that out, and then we will have a little double, can space that out some more and then a little double they'll come around this turn right here and then the next section we're just going to make this a little whoop section so we'll start off these small whoops then work our way up like that and then that's going to drop down then we'll space that out a little bit then we'll put in a little triple then we're coming around right here throw in a few whoops so put in a little whoop section again and then we'll have actually let's back that up a little bit then we're going to have our finish line jump okay and then We'll have it go back onto the track, curve like that. There we go. So let's go ahead and try it out. All right, so we're going around. Obviously, that's as small as we can get the start to go. So come around here and remember that we're on a factory 450. So usually you're like on super minis or like 85s or stuff like that. Okay, so that double right there might need to change this landing because that's a bit big and a bit too spaced out, especially for an arena cross track. But then we got this little double right here which can't seem to quite get onto might have to make that lip a bit bigger on it as well come on this turn which is just a whoop section to a triple which we can easily overshoot and then this whoop section and then the finish line jump so obviously the tracks very short as it's arena cross track so actually I think I'm gonna change up that finish line jump to make that a bigger lip because that's about the same size as the landing let's go ahead and do a little quick more but let's go ahead and go around one more time so I got that which you can jump over and this we got to make that closer or something right there it's not working out come around this whoop section I think this triple will be easy well obviously it's easy on a 450 so it'll work out on a 250 as well but I would love to see a DLC where they add like 85s or like super minis and 125s. I think that'd be really cool if they could add that, but who knows? I don't think they can get the licensing for that. All right, so I'm, a, I, okay, so I lied. I'm gonna go around one more time. So let's see, we got this, which really should be like jumping on and off. And then this double. So I think this section we're gonna redo and then we'll try it again. All right, so we're gonna back it up and go to that section. 
So let's see, honestly, let's just clear it all the way out. I'm not really happy with it at all. We'll put in a table. I liked how we did that right there. That was pretty cool. Then we'll have that come off, space it out a little bit, and then we'll have this, space it out, make this a little double right here, and it'll come through here, and then we can just put in this little triple right there, and then the rest of it should be fine. So let's go ahead and try this out now and see how it works. Okay, so this section should be good still. So I got that little double and this triple. Okay, perfect. Barely gave it gas and I was able to clear out on a 450, which means I should be able to easily do it on the 250s. So I think it actually turned out pretty good. Nice two little whoop sections. And we actually didn't change out the finish line jump. So let's see, I'll go around one more time, but it actually wasn't a problem that last lap. Maybe we had a better flow. But yeah, I think the finish line's actually fine. So let's go ahead and validate it and try it out. All right, so here's the track. It's obviously tiny because it's an arena cross track. So hopefully this video is not too short. So don't want to drag it out though as well. But I think it actually turned out pretty good and we were able to knock it out really quickly. So if you guys wanted to see a series of me just making different arena cross tracks and maybe we can race on them, let me know in the comments below. That'd actually be something that maybe I could do. But let's go ahead and validate it real quick. But this actually turned out really good. All right, so obviously we're all on 450s, so we're gonna be overshooting these jumps. So we we'll actually do the little hot lap and all that stuff and the little time qualifying. I'll actually hop on a 250 just to make things more reasonable because right now I can just completely overshoot all these jumps. But this track is actually pretty fun and I'll be curious to see what the lap times are like. This should be very low, like maybe under 30 seconds, but I'll be curious to see if it's slower or significantly slower on a 250. Oh no, okay, so you do have to spread out wide, which I was afraid that was gonna happen just because how it crosses back over. But whatever, we just gotta keep that in mind. But this is actually the quickest I'm gonna validate a track just because it goes based off lap times. And obviously the lap times are very low. So actually we are done now. We're just gonna wait for the AI to hop back in. So unfortunately right here, we gotta remember to swing out far. All right, so we got the track validated. So let's go ahead and put it online. So obviously if you guys are on Xbox, you guys can go play it if you would like to. So we're just gonna name it AX for Arena Cross 1 and then Vice, why not? All right, so we got to upload it online. So now let's go ahead and try it out on a 250. All right, so we are on a 250 now, and we're gonna be just doing some time attack. I'll be curious to see what the lap times are like. So obviously gotta remember to swing out wide right there. So let's see. Okay, coming up a little bit short on that. Maybe just how I hit it. Let's see this triple. Okay, that's not gonna be a problem. So it actually works out perfect. Then this whoop section. And then this triple. Oh yeah, we got plenty of speed to hit that. And then let's see, is the finish line jump a problem? No, it's not. All right, so perfect. So lap time was actually 33 seconds. So let's see if we can actually get it down to 30 or lower. All right, so you guys know the drill. I'm gonna go ahead and try and put in a hot lap, which basically I just go around the track a few times and see if I can get a really low lap time. And then we'll have a little montage of it from the different perspectives. And then that's pretty much it. Everyone got an opinion. They given the chance, they decided to betray me. Now I'll be packing our shows. And if you wanna come to the function, then you gotta pay me. Uh, get off your and go get you some money for once instead of being lazy. Just got a rap there and slam that I'm money from thee like I'm tracing McGrady. I'm going stupid. Everyone's statically choosing to sit on the couch and start moving. I hop on the beat and I'm steadily grooving. Red Louis Vuitton with the forces, I'm Cuban. Throw back to Louis Vuitton. I do the dash and I'm gone. I don't care if I'm in or wrong, it's either way, whenever it's all said and done. It's Gonna end up in a song. Get her mouth, she say all I can check up. Water on me, trip or jump from the neck up. If you want problems, then people step up. It's like Thanksgiving, how I leave them fed up. I'm so ahead of the times. All of the love is divine. I think I'ma make it shine. I leave a bruise from behind. Me on the beat. Alright, so that was the hot lap for this arena cross track. Obviously, I gotta upload it online under AX1 Vice. So if you guys wanna go play it, it's online Xbox only. But yeah, hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And I'm um, trying to get some more videos out, hopefully pretty soon. I'm trying to get back on the grind. And I'm actually looking at getting a new camera. So once I do that, I'll actually do a video on my Mac because I've had it for over a month now. And I said I was gonna do a video of using it after a while just to see how I liked it from switching from a Windows. So be on the lookout for that. Hopefully I can purchase that camera soon. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Please go check out the merch. It's always linked in the description and in the corner right there. So yeah, merch is the best way to help support the channel. So hopefully I'll see you guys soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye.